Hey everybody, my name is Gundam, welcome back for another video of Still Rising. We're gonna continue this series, boys having a lot of fun playing this game for you guys. So uh, we're back for some more uh, right here. What we're gonna do here is we're gonna continue on our path towards this location. Continue to do 30 minute videos for this. I'm kind of like really intrigued and probably doing like a longer video for this one, but I'm not too sure thing is doing longer videos it requires me to do stay longer uh do longer recording periods of time right with other videos as well i've got so many games i'm gonna have to play so i don't know boys it requires me to stay well uh in the re in the recording studio and stuff like that and it it can get very hot really quick it can get very tired uh, tiresome really quick so i don't know i kind of want to chill out a little bit i'm not too sure boys i'm not too sure We're, we'll see how it goes let's unlock this path this lock is unlocked by this uh, mechanism all right there we go so we've unlocked those doors is there a way for me to get to the riders the thing is i need to i don't think i'm gonna be able to do that anyways boys we're just gonna keep moving for now we'll go to the, the invalid's place do our thing really quick Defeat all these uh, bosses that are coming up at us real quick. There's some spider thingies as well. Ooh, we gotta watch out. Some spider thingies, boys. We gotta watch out for those. Ooh, alright, alright, alright. Watch out. Let me just defeat these. Oh, uh, we got another great three uh, that we just unlocked. Great. That's uh, really good, boys. Thing is, if I unlock at least more modules, you know, it would be great, but the thing is, I'm not, so. Uh, I'm kind of have those really good modules waiting for me to un uh, equip, but can't do that because I don't have the module keys for them. So I need to unlock those module keys first. Let's see, the Envalis place is over here. I can probably. I mean, what's over there? I don't know what's over there, so. I don't think it's anything interesting, really. I gotta keep moving, I guess. There's a letter there. Probably gonna be a uh, cutscene or something, boys. They're after us. You must carry on, I beg you. I, I will make it. I'm out of breath. Oh, I'm not dead here. Suzanne, just a bit more. We're almost there. Okay, so that's the uh, park, uh, the walk, uh, the pocket watch that she had. Interesting. So uh, we are now getting closer to them, uh, to some survivors. Getting closer to the survivors, boys, which is good news. Can I, can I jump, please? There we go. Always pressing the wrong thing every time. Okay, there we go. We're here. And this is. Seems to be another place, so let's keep it going, boys. Let's get that thing right here, and I'm just gonna do that. Ooh, that one did a lot of damage to me. Gotta be careful. This is gonna be a big dude. Okay, this is a big dude. Gotta watch out. Let me defeat that spider thingy first. And I'm gonna try and defeat... Uh, this, this, first off, defeat the, uh, the smaller enemies, and then focus on the other ones. I'm gonna do some flame grenades here and there. There we go. Bunch of flame grenades, boys. Watch out now. There we go. Just do a bunch of flame grenades and that does the damage for us, really. I got plenty of those, so... I can uh, definitely spare a bunch of them. I can definitely uh, use a bunch of them. I think we just need to go towards this direction now. Alright, what is this? We got another Vestal. Another Vestal that we can unlock, which we will do. And slaughtered the faithful. Oh, so we need to defeat the unstable automat first before using the uh, this stuff. So there is going to be a boss fight coming up. There's a boss fight in the area that we're going to need to defeat, boys. Not a problem, as long as it's not as difficult as one of the other ones, right? Uh, there was a really difficult one. Oh, there he is. Oh, there, it's a small one. It's a small enemy. He does do a lot of damage, though. We're gonna have to be careful about him. Let's go, boys. There we go. Keep attacking him. We gotta watch out. 
There we go, just like that. The, the, now the thing is, I am gonna actually try to uh, modify the other weapon. See if I can't do that, boys, and get a better weapon out of it. So I'm actually gonna switch weapons right here. Boom! Oh, I completely missed right here. Okay. I'm gonna have to heal myself and throw some grenades at him. There we go. Throw, throw some grenades at him, shoot the trick. Okay. Great. How about you don't do that, buddy? And how about I throw some grenades at you again? Okay, we gotta be careful right here. Oh, he keeps attacking me as well. Get him! There we go. I was struggling over there. Another module key, a business block as well, which is absolutely perfect. It's fantastic. It's uh, exactly what I needed in order for me to uh, upgrade properly uh, my other weapon. Woman's headpiece? Well, did she die or did she survive? I'm not too sure. Here's the thing. I tend to think that she would die, uh, have died, but we could be surprised, boys. Most of them actually survived. They are actually get, being kept alive. So I don't know. Maybe she survived somehow? I don't know. I really don't. I uh, We're supposed to go back here? Okay, there we go. So that's how we do it. And uh, there we go. So that's it right there, boys. Ooh, there's some enemies right here. Let's defeat them, boys. Now, there was uh, the vessel over there, but I forgot that it was there, boys, for some reason. Somehow I forgot after the cutscene that uh, there was a vessel there. I There's probably another, um, another one just waiting for us anyway, so not like we absolutely need to get there, you know. There is a place that we can uh, break really quick. Which I am gonna do. I'm gonna break the, that thing open uh, just to see. Oh, actually, it's not. It looked uh, from far away like a place we could break, but just not, boys. So, yeah, I don't think uh, there's nothing else for us to do here aside from just keep moving towards this direction right here. Going back, boys. Uh, we can unlock from this side now the the gates. Good. Good. That's done. Uh, now, though. I believe this is the only place we need to go at. Let's go back then. Love playing this game for you guys. Uh, it can be super uh, relaxing. While also be stressful at times. It's a perfect match boys. A perfect balance right now that's going on. So good. So we do need to get access somehow to this, this side. The only way for me to get access to this side is... VR key or something, boys. I need to figure that one out. First off, we do have a vessel inside the carriage. So let's go back in and actually upgrade our stuff really quick. Uh, I do need to equip my uh, fire and ice first. Let me do that. And now we're going to upgrade it. So the fire chain is actually better. It's actually better than the fire and ice uh, thing. I do think the fire and ice would be looking it would look really nice though because look at that it looks like a nice weapon the thing is it does less damage it does less damage but uh, I think I'm gonna keep the fire and ice just because I like it I like it a lot so I'm gonna sell a fire chain which uh, gave me an auriculum ingot from that that gave me uh, the auriculum ingot which is uh, really good well I already had it I think can I can I buy anything? Nothing at all, really. That's interesting. All right. Uh, is there anything, any grades that I don't need? There is this one. There we go. So now I got plenty of stuff, really. Uh, I actually got some improved frost grenade, improved flame grenade, and all that good stuff. So we got that. Carriage token. This device triggers a preset function that allows Aegis to return to her primary mode of transport automatically. Uh, I guess mine temporarily goes dormant as her body returns to the carriage via the 
I like that. I need that. So that's uh, that's a fast traveling. Uh, that's a way of fast traveling uh, quicker, boys. I like that. Uh, we are gonna do improved, improved frost grenades. We're gonna do both of them. Improved frost grenades and improved flame grenades. Both of those things, boys, would be really great for us. Uh, now that we got that, don't uh, can't really upgrade our uh, our things any uh, anymore. We just need two more abysmal blocks. Which I don't have access to that, so that's gonna have to wait. So in the meantime, then continue upgrade vigor right here. And for the next part, we're going to need at least four, uh, 44k for the next one. So until then, boys, let's upgrade our inventory really quick. Uh, upgrade our quick access belt. We're going to do some improved frost grenade, uh, flame grenades right here. Oh, no, improved fl uh, explosive grenades. Improved uh, flame grenades and improved frost grenades. We're going to do uh, both of those, uh, all four of those. All of them. I keep, let's uh, go back and finally do what we're supposed to do in the first place. We do need to get access to this place now. So the only way for us to do that is open this gate up. But how am I going to open this gate up, boys, without like... I need to get from uh, one side to the other, right? I need to get uh, find another way to get there. So I don't know. I, I really don't know. This weapon I really like though. I'm super fast with it, so I like I like it uh, a lot better already. Boys, there seems to be there was a bit uh, a way for us to do things. So uh, I'm going to show you really quick. Uh, it took me a while to figure it out. There was a wall right there, right where there's the tunnel and stuff. There was a wall right here. You can break. You hop in in there, and then you're back here. So that's what you were supposed to do the entire time. That's that wasn't that was confusing boys a little bit i gotta lie it was definitely a little bit confusing but now we're here uh we are finally here we're on this side uh, well we need to get to this side right here so we're gonna get there but first let's defeat these enemies really quick there we go let's defeat them really quick boys that's what i like to see right there boys so finally we uh i've managed to find a way to get there always drops me back towards the uh the the carriage if i die so there we go at least i made it now kind of scared i was gonna i wasn't gonna make it though so here we go so that's how you um you're supposed to get to all the the, the riders thing as well interesting another boss fight maybe Big enough, boys. Let's do our thing. Let's go, boys. There we go. There we go. Just like I, I like it, boys. Let's go ahead and defeat him. Uh, I do have some explosive grenades, some really improved ones as well. So let's defeat him really quick. There we go. Nice. There we go. So we're just gonna keep uh, doing the explosion grenades and all that good stuff. That should do, uh, do about the trick, boys, right there. With my heavy weapon and stuff like that, that does a lot of damage. It's gotta be extra careful, though. There we go. With my heavy weapon, uh, my my grenades and stuff like that, I shouldn't be in trouble at all. Uh, this it, it looks like he's the same type as me right now. He uses a, a big heavy weapon and stuff, so he's slow and it's really uh, not that difficult to catch right here. I do have to be careful. He does have this. Uh, these abilities and whatnot. Let's go. Let's use all the grenades I can, boys. Ooh, watch out now. He does do a little bit of damage to me. That's for sure. There we go. Just like that. I'm gonna have to heal myself up a little bit right here. I need to do that and throw some frost grenades in there as well. Look at the damage he's been dealt with, boys. Get him again and one last time. He's done. Done just like that, boys.
So now we've got that. Let me pick that up. We got a great, uh, a great two thing, another Ericulum ingot, and some module key uh, as well. I just need some bismuth blocks, though. That's what I need most. So I got a bunch of stuff. I already used everything I got. Uh, I had for the, uh, for the the approved stuff. So now I'm good. Uh, we are gonna equip. Uh, where's the frost grenades at? So frost grenades. I still have some. Let me just do the regular ones then. So uh, that's good on its own. Let me just heal myself a little bit further. We're good to go. I do want to see if I can't uh, unlock this guy or free him. I do have 132k as well. That's a lot. Uh, frost resistance. I can probably modify it for reinforced armor. Yeah. Let's do reinforced armor and stuff uh, instead. How many? I do have uh, six module keys. I'm going to be able to uh, upgrade it so that I can use a module, uh, a grade three module, really. So I don't have all the echoes. I need particular stuff in order to, like, free these people. I don't know how to do that. I'm legit going to need a bunch of, like, I need echoes and stuff like that in order to free them. And I don't know how to do that. I don't know how to free those people. So they're probably going to stay there forever because i don't know how to, i'm going to be able to free the, those people unfortunately uh i'm not getting anything really crazy in terms of armor so that's good uh we've got the vestal right here let me just do the uh all the upgrades really quick all right everything's been upgraded to do as much as i could boys so i'm now uh up to 29k of anima and that's not enough i need 49k to upgrade even further uh we have i did unlock the uh level three a module right there boys so that's unlocked it's at max level uh, level so grade three seems to be the max in this game and uh the rest i don't have i can't do anything uh, uh, anything about any of those so good to go let's go uh and uh, keep moment uh, momentum going we can actually no interact with this and find out what happened to the riders boys let's do that all right, so you guys can read that. There we go. So report back to Marquis de Lafayette, boys. All right, that's all we got to do. Is just report back to the Lafayette. Uh, and once that is done, well, we'll be good to go, boys. We're going to be looking for the next mission right here. So let's go back to the carriage. And uh, fast travel back to uh, the next area, really. We need to go back to the convent. All right, boys. We're going to be finally be able to get through that location. Uh, simply because now I've got the ability to get past these gates, right? I can actually uh, push these back up, uh, these uh, gates back up. So now we're going to be able to find this uh, Tina girl, uh, Athenaeus or whatever. Find her and save her if she's still alive, that is. We do have a Vestal over here. Let's uh, equip it really quick. I finally got past the gardens. I had to go all the way back though in order to do that. That was something else. Uh, let's uh, upgrade our stuff really quick. I can't upgrade any of these obviously because I need to uh, to get my hands on some bismuth blocks. Which apparently are super hard to find boys. I don't know how to find those. So let me just upgrade myself then. I can't upgrade anything else. Um, first off, we're going to upgrade myself to level 20, which is the next part. 20 of power, so that's going to be the next thing to do. So now we're good to go. We've got nothing else to uh, that we can really upgrade. Let's keep it moving, boys. I think she was on the other side, so I believe I need to... Um, before I, I was going uh, off uh, on this direction the wrong way uh, right away. So I need to first off go through here. So search the hiding place. Oh, wait. Okay, so there's some letters here and there. There is a crate right here. I'm going to look at what we got inside of it. There we go. Oh, some bismuth blocks, boys. There it is. I just need another one. I need another bismuth blocks, and we're going to be good to go to at least upgrade one of the two weapons. Okay, so you guys can read that. And uh, we've got this right here. Broken fragment. What unusual names. Whose cane could this be? Perhaps the guests at the Cordelier can enlighten me. Perhaps they could. So I need to... No matter what happens, I need to go back to the convent. So 
uh, be for do that uh, in order to do that what we're gonna do is it's gonna be much simpler to just use uh, the items that I got right now which is uh, what uh, what you call it uh, one of the um, the carriage tokens I'm gonna use one of those there we go we're back at the carriage boys that's easy so now that was a good way of fast traveling and getting back quicker in a quicker or faster manner to the uh, convent boys much quicker way of doing that so happy I did that let's go ahead and interact with them see if they got any answers for me everybody's back here as well that's good to see she's back Aegis what a joy and relief to see you again monsieur welcome to our stronghold I'm sure that everyone here is aware of the great debt we all owe you as you can see, the most exhausted among us are growing stronger. While the most determined are already planning our counterattack. Alright, let's talk about the group first. Uh, we're gonna go in order, I guess. Four days ago, the representatives of the Third Estate gathered in a tennis court. They swore not to separate until they had established a constitution for the nation. But that was not the only oath we swore. All the honorable men who were at Versailles, representatives and patriots, members of the Club Breton, secretly swore to meet here if they were dispersed. You, Aegis, have allowed them to gather once again. Though unfortunately many are missing, we still have hope. Well, I do know about two people that uh, are missing and I could free, but I don't have the stuff to free them. So I'm not sure how I'm going to be uh, doing that exactly. What about the convent? Why did you choose to meet in this convent? It was my idea. Voyez-vous, I stay here whenever my obligations bring me to Paris. No other retreat inspires such peace and contemplation. Et puis, truth be told, this building has always felt like a fortress to me. Just look at how thick these walls are. For two whole days, the patriots in the quarter consolidated the outer walls to make it an impenetrable citadel. No automat has broken through our defenses yet. That could change very soon. I don't know. Where are the monks, mon père? They are secluded in their quarters, praying for the salvation of the people of Paris. However, we bear no illusions. We are weak, we are divided, and we are unarmed. Without you, without your warrior strength, we have no chance of turning things around. You are sent by heaven above, Aegis. From now on, you may consider the Cordelia Convent your headquarters and a welcome refuge. We must speak, you and I, in private, if you please. Monsieur de Lafayette must not hear a word of what I'm about to tell you. What do you mean? You all seem to be certain that I will use my strengths to serve your cause. Are you forgetting that I have a task to accomplish? Not at all, madame. We all know and support your plan to free Monsieur de Vauconson. That is why I've taken the time to think of a way for you to get to the Bastille. I am listening. There is a patriot in Paris whose pamphlets have aroused Monsieur de Lafayette's ire. His anger is so strong that the poor man had to disappear to escape arrest. I know that he is secretly hiding in the quarries in Montmartre. A labyrinth he is said to know like the back of his hand. If anyone can help you navigate the obstacles that keep you from the Bastille, it is the elusive Monsieur Marat. Very well. I will go and find him. Well, all right. It sounds like our next move for us, boys, as as uh, uh, after we're done uh, reading that letter, is uh, we're going to need to go back to... Uh, we're we're going to need to find this uh, Monsieur Marat. Uh, apparently this guy, that, that guy in particular, can help us figure out uh, how to get to the Bastille, boys. How to get inside. So, uh, in due time, all that in due time. We've got all these letters right here. And uh, all these people that I saved are in here. Safe and sound. That's, uh, just, that's good to know, uh, boys. Super play. So, uh, I'll go ahead and uh, for now, I'll go ahead and stop the video. I think it's a good uh, place to end it, boys. I feel like we're really kind of getting close towards the end. If we look at the journal really quick, looks like we only have two missions. So, I don't know, boys. Uh, remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.